in his mercy is reaching out to you. He is warning you to get right with his son Jesus because judgment is coming. You don't have a long time here left. There's a day when you will give an account to God. Repent, sir. Turn to Jesus. And you see that when you preach. People, they stick the middle fingers. They are God haters. They will pass in their cars and stick the middle finger. But you won't stick the middle finger at God. Oh, you're not going to stick your middle fingers at God. You're not going to stand before God and shake your fist at Him. There's a day of judgment coming. And I'm warning you to wake up because time is running out. There is a day coming when you're going to be judged by God. And your only hope is Jesus. God offers forgiveness for your sin. But you have to repent. If you keep living ungodly, you're going to go to an ungodly, whole, unholy hell. You're going to go to a devil's hell if you keep living in sin and God is trying to get your attention. He's saying, wake up and get right with God. Put the alcohol down, fellas. No drunkard will enter into God's kingdom. That's what the Bible says. 1 Corinthians chapter 6. you got to repent, guys. If not, you're going to go to hell fire. Turn to Jesus. Confess your sin. Throw that alcohol drink in the garbage, sir, and pick up a Bible. Confess your sin and get right with God because judgment day is coming. And if you go to hell, it's going to be too late. If you go to hell, there's no second chances in hell. If you go to hell, you're not going to get another chance. That's it. You're going to burn in unquenchable fire. And there's no way to soothe that burning in hell. If you get burnt in this life, you may be able to put some burn cream on that burn, but there's no burn cream in hell. There's no burn cream in hell. You gotta repent. Of course, sir. You're, you're wicked and you need to repent, sir. Yeah, I, I do, I do, I do. Turn to the Lord, man. Don't go to hell, bro, because death is coming. There's gonna be a day y'all gonna die, man. <laughs> You're gonna, God. yes, you will, man. Yeah. Don't don't play with your life, man. You're gonna but stand we, before we, God, we, man. We, 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 Get right with God. Put the alcohol yeah. down. Live straight before the Lord, because judgment is coming. There is a day of judgment coming. Turn to the Lord, sir. There is a day where you are gonna give an account to God Almighty. And while you hear the preaching of God's word being preached, repent. And get right with Jesus. For there is only one name given amongst men that we can be saved. And his name is Jesus. Behold the Lamb of God. Who taketh away the sin of the world, sir. Jesus Christ made an atonement for sin. He died for sin. He was crucified. And he rose again from the dead on the third day. And now you could be justified by the grace of the Lord Jesus Christ. But you have to repent. You have to get right with God. For there is only one name given amongst men that we can be saved. And his name is Jesus but Jesus said in his word, so likewise, if you do not repent, you're going to perish. If you do not repent and get right with God, you're going to perish. You're going to go to hell fire. And there will be no second chances in hell. There's no second chances in hell, sir. When you go to hell, that's it. When you die in this life without salvation, you go to hell and that's it. And God is trying to get your attention. He's saying, don't go to hell. Repent and believe on the Lord while you hear the preaching of His Word being preached. Repent and get right with God because the clock is ticking down. And you won't be able to live the party life forever. There's a day when the party is going to come to an end. There's a day when all the drinking, the alcohol, and smoking weed, it's all going to come to an end. No weed smoker will enter into God's kingdom. 
No person who practices sexual sin will enter into God's kingdom. You have to repent and live right before the Lord. The Bible says to be holy because God is holy. The Bible says without holiness, no one will see the Lord, sir. That means you got to come to Jesus, believe in the Lord, put your faith in God. Sir, you're deceived. Repent and believe on the Lord. Turn to Jesus while you hear the preaching of His Word being preached. Do not harden your heart and keep going off in sin, sir. God in His mercy is trying to get your attention, but you've got to wake up because that day of judgment is coming. There's a day that you're going to give an account to Almighty God. And your only way into God's holy heaven is to come to God's holy Son. God sent His only begotten Son, ma'am, into the world to die for your sin. Jesus Christ, He died for the sin of the world, so now sinners could be saved. But now the sinner must repent. You can't keep having a blasphemous, filthy, cussing mouth and think you're going to be okay with God. You have to repent. You have to get your heart washed with the washing of the water by the Word of God, and then your mouth will clean up. You won't have a filthy, blasphemous, cussing mouth when you get right with God. Turn to the Lord and repent. Believe on Jesus while there's still breath in your body because there's coming a day, young man, that you're not going to be here. If God calls your soul into account tonight, sir, are you ready to stand before God? Because you're not promised to see tomorrow. There's people that think they're going to live a long life, but life comes to an end for them. Their life is cut short because something happens. You're not guaranteed to see tomorrow. Repent while you hear the preaching of God's word being preached because judgment is coming.